Hi Capricorn, this is your forecast for the month of February 2017. This is a general reading for Capricorn Sun, Capricorn Rising, or Capricorn Moon. If you have a different rising or moon sign, you might find watching those videos helpful or more informative for you. Please remember that these are general readings and so they may not apply to everyone. If you would like a personal reading that is specific to you, please visit my website at thealchemistastrologer.com provided on the link at the upper corner. If you have visited my site before, you'll need to clear your browser's cache for the schedule button to function properly. Now the last week you have this great card, you have the Magician. So you have everything at your disposal, whatever's going on, you have exactly what you need. Now this could be a very creative period for you because, and maybe someone from the past is opening some creative opportunity for you because this card can be someone who's highly creative. Uh, this is perhaps dealings with an important male figure. This could be a brother, a father, a boyfriend, just an important male and somebody who possesses some type of special skill or knowledge. Could be technical, uh, could be technology, could be medical expertise, could be artistic expertise. Uh, so you may be dealing with, you know, somebody that works on computers or somebody who uh, uses some kind of tool or instrument or perhaps as, as I said some artisan a craftsman an artist or perhaps a medical specialist or uh, somebody that deals with the spoken word somebody entrepreneurial whoever this is this is somebody who knows how to manipulate the physical world in order to achieve their means so this could be a week if it's you you are manifesting what you have envisioned you have the ability to promote yourself to market yourself to push your agenda now for others of you uh, you're dealing with somebody who is tricky this is an, imp an imposter, somebody who is manipulating a situation in order to gain some power. Uh, this could be somebody who is selfish or obstructing your goals in some way. This could be somebody who thinks they know everything, a know-it-all, a self-proclaimed genius who really is just overconfident in their skills, their knowledge, and basically they're a con artist or a screw-up. But on the positive, this could be a week where you're trying to gain mastery of some kind of knowledge, you're focusing your energy, you want to achieve a goal, and you have the ability to make decisions on your feet, quick decisions, on the move, being adaptable, because you're confident, you believe in yourself, and you're self-determined. Now, it could be some errors along the way. You could be checking things out. This could be a trial and error. Again, you're trying to learn something. You're trying to master something. This could be a week where there's some opportunities that are presenting, and or maybe you're trying to solve some problems, and you're coming up with some brilliant solutions, or you're making that necessary change. You're adapting. Uh, some of you are self-employed. Whatever it is, you're being inventive, you're being creative, you're being uh, assertive, you're taking the initiative to help yourself. And that is the key, applying your will uh, constructively in order to bring you that reward. So you're likely to take a stand, uh, put yourself out there, uh, and in the process, people are going to notice you. They won't be able to, you know, get around noticing you. They see you for your skills, for your efforts, for your services, and you gain some kind of recognition. Now, for others of you, you know, something is blocked. Maybe, you know, your creativity is blocked. You can't come up with any ideas or you feel like you're in a situation where, you know, you're not authentic. You say you're an expert and yet you don't really have the skills or vice versa or there's some indecision you don't feel confident there's not an ability to move forward because you're not seeing things for what they really are 
Uh, and so, in, a, in essence, there's impotence, there's a delay, you're blocked from taking action, or there's a reluctance on your part to take a chance. Maybe you're afraid you're going to make a mistake, or, you know, maybe you're literally dealing with some kind of technological failure where you can't move forward. Uh, whatever it is, there could be either avoiding your problems because of lack of confidence or you don't know what you're doing and you're just being too arrogant or you're dealing with somebody that like that but this is a week about being a self-starter taking the initiative relying on yourself and the more you do that the closer you get to that finish line uh, now some of you may feel as if you are making progress things are moving forward in fact it's almost too good to be true and you do need to change your perspective you could feel like maybe all of my luck all of my success is just a trick you know you know I'm gonna put my hand in that uh, hat and there's not gonna be a rabbit to pull out well that is not the case that's just your fear and your lack of confidence and your ego talking to you in the wrong way but you do need to be careful about being impulsive, by, by rushing, by being arrogant, by being impatient, by being frustrated, uh, and letting that push you in ways that, you know, are not constructive, not applying your will in ways that hurt, hurt, uh, not applying your will in ways that help you, but rather hurt you. So again, this could tie back to selfishness. You are you know, encouraged to take that self-initiative, to have self-reliance, to promote self, but not to take that to where you are obsessively concerned with self, where you are disregarding other people, what they think, their advice and their opinions. So this could be a week, again, where you are noticed for your skills, your services, your talents, your charisma, your charm. Uh, it could be a week of appreciation where there is gratification and you feel an enjoyment of life. Uh, of life. You feel a sense of contentment, of abundance. Or you may realize that you are clinging to the past and trying to hold on to something. 